little old ladies that raised their kids here, and then all of a sudden they don't have no no heart, no sympathy for us, and just want to throw us out of here like we're dogs. Um, I mean, some of us pay thousands of dollars weekly here, uh, and for all of a sudden they tell us you got two weeks or three weeks to leave. I have 45 pallets in the store. I just replaced my roof, cost me 7,000 to protect my merchandise. And what are they gonna do with this? Demolish it? Why didn't they tell us this at the beginning of the year? Okay, I want to go back to uh, us here because we're going to go to Uvalde, Texas, where that school shooting uh, happened momentarily and a special report is happening. This is an NBC News special report. Here's Lester Holt. Good day, everyone. We're coming on the air with breaking news of a shooting at an elementary school just outside of San Antonio, Texas. A hospital official says at least two people are dead and 13 children are injured following the incident at Robb Elementary School in Uvalde, Texas. Their conditions are currently unknown. We expect to learn more about all this shortly from a press conference that officials are about to give. We've been getting reports over the last couple of hours about an active shooter situation there. Uh, but again, few details have made their way out of there. I want to go to NBC News correspondent Gabe Gutierrez, who's been watching and monitoring uh, the situation. What do you know, Gabe? 